we made memories, we made up a poem about the character carrots because they don't look anything like carrots, but they do have character. Good morning. I looked really like, I was like looking into the camera like this because I was trying to see if it was focused. We just got back. We helped our friend move a piece of furniture. And before that, we had a couple of kiddos here. And what we did with the kiddos is we harvested vegetables. Yes. <laughs> we harvested all the carrots. Those are not carrots. And we also <laughs> harvested the onions. These are quite small. They barely grew at all. So that's a learning experience. Here's the leftovers of the carrots. Oh yeah, we let them pick out all they wanted. I would say we... This was full. Yes. Would you say it was about two or three pounds? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. So these are very small. And like, this is a big one. And that's, you know, quite small. But it was so much fun. We made memories. We made up a poem about the character carrots. Because they don't look anything like carrots, but they do have character. Eric, you should say the poem we have so far. Oh, let me, let me find it. You guys ready for this? I'm a character carrot and I'm here to say I'm not like the rest and that's okay. The ones at the store are perfect in shape, but they don't have ones that look like a grape. There's one that looks like a hive for a bee. There's even one that looks like a C. It's character carrots. Character carrots. <laughs> yes. So you get, that, you get that little bonus for free. We had fun with the kids. I just filmed the whole clip. It wasn't on. Okay. <laughs> I, I bought this at the consignment store yesterday and I of course we're not chosen yet so we don't know if we're going to have a boy or a girl but it's good to have a couple of pieces of clothing either way and I just love this fabric it's so sweet and it's so cute we couldn't not someday we are back from our walk and it is time <laughs> sorry babe He's going to the restroom. And I heard him close the door after I started vlogging. Sorry about that. Um, uh, it is time, hi Harry, to make some food. I have tomatoes that I need to use up from our garden. I need to get an onion. So let's see here. <laughs> That's so cool. Got an onion. It's very small. <laughs> How big were the onions that we planted? Pretty much that size. <laughs> no, they were they were at least half this size. I'm I'm thinking these doubled in size. So oh, okay. we did grow them. Okay. But this is <laughs> tiny. <laughs> here, I'll hold it up here so it looks like it's really big. <laughs> Couple in North Carolina grows giant onions. Yeah, I have tomatoes that I chopped up a couple days ago. They were sitting on the counter. They smell quite strong. And I have a few more tomatoes, at least this one that I need to cut up as well. I'm just gonna go ahead and make, oh, this is the only onion we have. We don't have actual onion. So, oh well. And then I need to cut up the carrots. I think I'm gonna freeze them to use for soup or something like that. Hi, baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's totally an onion. Wonderful. Look at that. Tiny and wonderful. I kind of feel like I'm on like those miniature cooking videos on Facebook. That is a legit onion. Yay.
Okay, so you guys, um, with the nature of adoption, there are a lot of unknowns. And Peter and I have been trying to educate ourselves with some of those unknowns. And so we've been doing, I don't know, educational um, reading and listening to podcasts from people who have walked through stuff we haven't. And one of the things we signed up for is a three-day kind of mini course and like on an adoption topic. And I put it in my calendar. I signed up for all three, you know, course days and I put it in my calendar on the days that I thought that it was happening. And last Saturday I had like an hour of mourning because I thought that we missed the first day. I thought that it was last Saturday and I realized it like at 5 p.m. and it started at 4 and I was just so sad. I felt so bad because we had signed up and it's a Zoom call. I'm not sure yeah, if it's interactive or not, but I just, I felt bad. Anyway, today was the next one. So we had it on our calendars and I, we had a timer set and we came home from our errands. We sat at the table with our computer and Peter was pulling up the Zoom call and he's like, oh, oh, it's in September. It's this date in September. And I was so relieved because that means we didn't miss any of the calls. Also, that means my brain is a little bit full right now and I'm putting it on um, scheduling things on the days that they're not existing. Just two cuties. Just hanging out with my boy and um, looking on slides for church tomorrow. All right, I am sent on a mission while Mary's making dinner to go up to the baby's room and, whoa, I almost fell up the stairs. The light in here, we have a ceiling fan light. Ceiling fan in here, wait. Yeah, the light makes like a high-pitched humming noise and I'm not sure why, so I've been sent to figure this out. I think what we might do is grab new light bulbs, see if perhaps it's the light bulbs. If it's not that, I don't know why it would be making this. It's, it's kind of like if you sit in here for a while, it gets to you. So let's see if we can get these light bulbs out of here. here let's turn the light off. There we go. All right. That's hot. Okay, I'll wait till that cools off. Here's what I ended up with. Four cups of chopped carrots for soup. I'm gonna freeze those and 
some leftover carrots that maybe we'll eat in the next few days that I'll keep in the fridge. Oh yeah, and here's my sauce. We've been enjoying this with ravioli and I think we still have a few in the freezer. And so, oh yeah, we have a few. So that will be a meal whenever we're hungry for one. Well, hey there. Hi. <laughs> what are you up to? I am looking at baby clothes online. Our evenings lately often end or wrap up here in the baby room. Mary will be sitting in the rocker and I'll come up after finishing up, cleaning up or working or whatever I've been doing and we come in here and I'll sit on the little um, footstool and chill rock and we pray for our baby and his family and for her oh yeah her family I don't know I think I got almost all the laundry done today amazing Oops, hi. Oh. and Harry absolutely loves the rocking chair which is so surprising to me because I had the impression that cats wouldn't like movement but he loves being rocked, and so anytime Mary's in here, he comes running. <laughs> so, these are the simple joys we're enjoying right now. Leave a comment down below and let us know a simple joy that you are appreciating today. And, as always, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Harry, you get to end the vlog because Ollie's eating his dinner. Good night, buddy.